Switzerland is a country that's enjoyed huge success in mountain biking, but not in downhill. It's in cross country that they rule supreme. Kids here don't grow up wanting to be a downhill star. They dream of being a cross country racer. And I'm here to meet one of their finest. She's the youngest woman ever to become an overall World Cup winner at just 21 years old. She truly is a phenomenal talent. It's Yolanda Neck. I've always wondered why Switzerland is so, so good at cross country. Hopefully, this place we're going now is going to help me find out. can do everything. So in the fun. warm? Exactly. <laughs> it's absolutely the best training facility I've ever seen. <laughs> it, it's perfect. How do you think this benefits you on the racetrack? So much. I mean, yeah, yeah those are all the skills you need. Bunny hops, those stairs, that's like uh, riding on a cross-country trail. Yeah, because the cross-country tracks now at World Cups are becoming more and more man-made. Yeah. I mean, we're seeing more and more of these kind of features yeah, in exactly. them. exactly. Is it competitive in here a little bit? Uh, it is. Of course it is, you're involved. Yeah, how could it be different? Yeah. Those are the girls that I'm racing and yeah. they are racing me. So we learn from each other, but at the same time we have fun together and we fight and we all want to get better. I like it. Yeah. It's not what I expected, but it shows me why you're so good at the technical parts of World Cup tracks. This is not what I'd expect to see Olympic cross-country endurance athletes doing. How did this come about? Well, we realized that there's a lot of potential in the technique part of cross-country racing. Yeah. How fluid you can ride, how efficient you can ride. Yeah. In, in the beginning, it was hard to kind of explain to some of the girls sometimes, why do we have to do this? Yeah. This is not in the woods, this is not what we do. But in the end, I mean, the basic bike handling techniques, they transfer straight into the racing, what they need over there. Yeah. So. Why bicycle soccer? If you think about it, you have to be precise. Yeah. The orientation is really important. Where this and other are yeah. the other ones. Be able to lift your wheel exactly at the right moment, Click it. in the right direction. What is it that makes Yolanda so special? She's always up for any challenge. So she's never holding back. It's more of like breaking her, <laughs> holding her back a yeah. little bit sometimes. So, so she doesn't go too crazy. That's a difficult job. But it's a nice one, you know, you need people to work with who are motivated and she's always ready to try something new and, and that's, that's one of the reasons I'm sure why she's so strong. When it comes to racing, who are the key people closest to you? My parents are definitely a big part of, of my life and as well of my racing. Yeah. Whenever I'm home, they are so supportive. They help me with whatever I do. They also give me my freedom. Yeah. And yeah, it's just still so much fun together with my dad. Also yeah. on the bike, he's just choking all the time. Even if I would try to fight with him, it wouldn't work because <laughs> he would make a choke <laughs> out of it. And you, you wouldn't be where you are without him now? Absolutely not. I, I think I wouldn't even ride bikes. Really? <laughs> that would be a great ass. <laughs> Yolanda's made it very clear just how important her family are to her success, especially her dad. And I'm very intrigued to meet him. Hello, Mr. Neff. How are you? Are you good? You're a pretty good mountain bike rider yourself, I think it's fair to say. I did what I could, so... A silver medal at the Masters World Championships wasn't bad, though. Yeah, but that was 20 years ago. <laughs> well, yeah. I guess Yolanda took over shortly after that, though. Yeah, probably. She started with her first race around six years. Did you think Yolanda's going to be good at mountain biking? Sure, I could see some talent, but always I was defensive in this 
point. You were, yeah, yeah. yeah. Not to push them too hard either. It's difficult balance as a, as a yeah, father, though. Uh, maybe. Yolanda is now huge on the world stage of mountain biking. What's it like watching her taking huge risks on the descent, smashing the climbs, the blonde hair hanging out the back? I mean, she's, she's a phenomenon on a mountain yeah. bike, isn't she? I really kind of proud of it. Yeah. She's almost fearless. I mean, she get that from you? Probably. <laughs> Well, the Neffs are clearly a very sporty family, and that includes the mum who's got her own fitness studio in town where she hosts all manner of classes. She's also Yolanda's core coach. Now, I'm very intrigued to see exactly what that entails. It's like watching Federer and Adele. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, this is core training, and mm -hmm. how important is that to Yolanda on her bike? I think it's very important for the balance. Yeah. Uh, for the reaction. To be strong in the middle. Yeah, uh -huh. For linking the brain halves. Oh, is yeah. that right? Yeah, yeah. And you feel the difference. Yeah, if I don't do it and I go on the bike, I feel like wobbly. So you wouldn't be without these exercises? No, no, they are key come up again slowly, slowly. How nice is it for you to have your closest family, your mum and dad, take care of your training? My dad has been my coach all my life and also my mum is uh, close to everything and they are coming to a lot of races, so uh, they are really important to me. I think if I would be home all the time, I would probably be not as close to my parents as I am. Right, yeah. yeah. It's also nice when she leaves. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's be honest. <laughs>
So, you know, 2017, looking forward to it, you ready? I'm so excited for this season, I'm really looking forward to um, going to all the races together with the team, I think we're going to have a great time together. I think we're going to see you on the top of the podium a few times this year. Yeah, we hope so. Yeah. Well, thanks very much for your time and after following you two all day, I'm going to be the first down this trail. Bye! <laughs> Well, it's been great hanging out with Yolanda for a few days. I mean, man, is she so much fun. I've had such a laugh. She's an amazing role model for women's sport, an inspiration. And, you know, with riders like her at the top in Switzerland, this country's success is just going to keep going. <laughs> Cracked my nuts so hard. Oh, my God. <laughs>